Hey guys, Rich from Tiger Fitness, and today we're gonna to be going through one intense workout. The workout is gonna be 24 minutes long with very little rest in between. We're gonna go through 12 different movements, and each set is gonna be broken down into three movements. Two main movements, which are gonna be full body, and then we're gonna finish off with a little bit of core. Each round's gonna get slightly harder, so beware for that. Make sure before you start this workout, you've had a good full warm up, and you've got plenty of fluids on board. I always advise having about half a pint of water, 45 minutes to an hour before working out. Big 24 minutes, let's do it. <laughs> right, let's start with a nice casual jog in the spot, just to loosen off. First exercise, 180 walkout press ups. So, get yourselves ready in this position. Fingers down to the toes, walk it out. One push up. Walk it back in again, touch the toes, spin it round. Bring the chest all the way down to that push up. If you're restricted like me, feet your space. Just walk the feet out before you walk the hands out. Last rep. 12 seconds recovery. In out, cross out, squat jumps next. Find that squat frame, hands to the shoulders, elbows up, and we just jump in and out. Nice and deep with the landers. Get that progression as we force our legs up through the air. Elbows remain high. One more rep, come on. Okay, shake it out. We're gonna do both of those exercises back to back. So get ready for them push-ups. Touch your toes, walk it out. Chest down to the ground. Walk it back up, spin the legs. And we go back around, opposite side. If you want the 180 to be a jump, Bring that one eight to jump. Right, back into the Cossack squat jump. Let's go. Heart rate should be rising now. Lung rate should be rising. And you can start the feeling in those legs. Keep those elbows up high. Three, two, one. Rest. 20 seconds. Right, core exercise. 35 seconds of your V-slip freeze. Grab your mat if you need it. Onto the bum. Legs in the air. Nice and straight. Arms up. Control the breathing. Stay on the ball of that bum. If you're feeling a little bit wobbly, bring the hands down just slightly to the side. You don't want to plant those hands down, but just give yourself a little bit of stability. Four, three, two, one, and rest. Twenty seconds recovery. Next exercise is skaters. So jumping from one foot, we're landing on both feet. Give yourself that space. We're in, jump on the outside leg, land nice and soft, bend to the knees, jump to the opposite side. We're in, little jump over, nice and soft with those legs. Make sure you can fit on the inside and the outside of those pins. I've got a power of jumping towards this camera. Three seconds, last rep. 12 seconds recovery. Arch and press up, so down to the floor. Side in the middle. So one hand out, but keep the pressure on the inside arm. Bring that inside, the outside arm in. Switch the sides over. But keep the body in line with those heels. So most of that pressure, most of that power has to come 
come from the inside arm and the inside chest. We rest. Both exercises back to back. Start with them skaters. Take a breath. Ready. Here we go. Jump out. Land nice and soft. We go again. Jumping over. Refreshing if you need to. Step it. Give it a little squat. Step it. Give it a little squat. Ready for those arch press ups. Down to the ground. Here we go. Refreshing like any push up movement is down to the knees. Make it slightly easier on yourself, but keep the pressure there in the chest. 20 seconds rest. Core exercise, 45 seconds of your hot knees. So it's hands under the shoulders, knees directly underneath those hips, on the toes. And we bring the hand to meet the knee, but on the opposite side. Knees have to remain as close to the floor as possible. You have minimum movement through the core. Imagine you're balancing a hot bowl of soup on your back. You don't want to spill it. Establish your two points of contact. Three seconds. And rest. Go drink. Burpee squat for us next. So into a burpee, one squat for us and then come back up again. Ready team. So down. Squat for us, up the burpee. Clap at the top. So to jump out, jump in, jump out, jump in and up. So you get one more team. Yeah, 12 seconds. Rebound, long jump. So bring the bump down, go as far as you can. Land soft, switch it round. Go as you jump, but stop yourself. Bring the bum down, and then jump. There's a big powerful movement, and then we go for the jump. Keep the pressure there. Relax. Really like, There's too much to jump. Come down and just step. Drop it down. Switch round. Take it down and step. Rest up. We're going to put those exercises together now. Burpee squat for us to start. Ready? Let's go. Heels down before we jump. We're going to come to this position here as the jump in. Yep. Oh, big round long jump. My bad. We're going to the, the Cossack. So, rebound as the jump. Big round. Rebound as the jump. Last one, come on. Rebound. Jump. Shake it out. Thirty-five seconds of that reverse plank. I'm going to get my mat down. Probably don't need it. So it's hand behind the shoulders, onto the heels, squeeze the glutes, bring those hips up. Look up towards the ceiling. Come as high as you can with those hips. You're engaged with the core. If you've got tight shoulders, you might feel it in this. And if that's the case, just drop the hips a little bit. So just try and keep that midsection engaged. Keep the chin pointing up, keep the eyes pointing up. Control the breathing. Three, two, one, and bring that bum down to the ground. Next pair. 
So we're going to lateral squat walk next, guys. So just like a normal squat walk, we're going side to side. So give yourself enough room, bring the bum down, bring your arms out in line with the shoulders, and just step out wide as you can, but keeping those hips down low. That's it. And if you can feel it all around this area, the glutes tightening, they're engaging. Big step. I'm going to change my to twos now. We rest. Bring it up. Next exercise, sprint. Fast as we can on the spot. You know exactly what this is about. Ready? Here we go. Now a lot of people will think that this is a sprint. That's not a sprint. This is a sprint. Moving those arms up. Putting those elbows back. Keeping the chin up. Moving those legs as fast as possible. By the end of this, you should be gas. And rest. Good breather. Lateral squat walks. Okay, starting off from the bum. Step out. Step out. Nice, slow, controlled movements. Keeping it as deep as we can towards the ground. Come on, team. Ready for sprints. Take it back to the middle, here we go. Fast as we can. It's not just the legs that move here. We're going to tense that chest up. Pull through the arms. Pull back to the elbows. Rest. Take a breather, I'll go back to core. So. We're going to go down to that crucifix plank. Hands as wide as possible. Bring those hands down. And let me go. We're just going to hold here. Bring that weight over the hands. So you're not too far back. Squeeze the core in. Focus the breath. If you're out of breath, this move is going to be a lot harder for you. You need to regulate that breathing. Do a straight line with the back of your shoulders, to the back of those heels. Three, two, one, and rest. Right guys, 25 seconds. Round one's been dusted. Get a drink. Next round, all the exercises, 20 seconds work. So you guys, 180 press ups ready? Here we go. Get the chest down, walk it back up. I'm stepping out before I'm turning to give myself the room. But if you want the extra, you can add that jump. Last rep, come on. 10 seconds rest. In out, cross out, squat jumps next. Deep breath in, hands on the shoulders, elbows up. Let's go. Jump it up and down. In and out. So you get a height, it's that height that's going to make the legs work. The higher you jump, the more body weight you have landed, the more control you need. One more. Woo! Shake it. V sit freeze, down to the floor. Really, we breathe. Heels up, arms up. Try and keep that back straight to the chest up. Push through the heels. It's gonna help you lock out those legs. Keep it as tight as possible. We're going to skate this next. Find the space, ready for the jump. Here we go. Jump with the outside leg. Really put the pressure through. Land nice and soft. Come on. Yep. Woo! 
Yes, team. Come on. One more. There it is. Three. Arch oh, press up, stand to the floor. One arm out, one arm in. And we go down on the inside arm. Get us last rep, team. Woo! Hot knees down to the ground. Hand on the shoulders, knees under the hips, on the toes. This one's going to be a little bit harder to do a bit more gas. So just slow the movement down. Steady the body and raise the knee up to meet the hand. Slow movements here. This is what we want. Keep those knees close to the floor. We rest. Bring it up. Burpee score for us. Deep breath in. Let's take it down. So we want to be seen at the top of the top. Legs in and out in and out. We have to jump for the burpee. Rebound long jumps. Deep breath in. Start with the bum low. Jump up. Land. Turn it round. Rebound. And then we jump. Up. Up. You want the extra as the tuck in through the knees. Last one. Reverse plank, team down to the ground. Hands down, heels down. Hips up. Look at that ceiling. Focus the breath. You're going to need to calm those lungs down. Ready for the next bit. Deep breath, team, come on. Hips up high. Bum down. Lateral squat or next. Depend on the space you've got. Try and get two, three, or four long spreads of those legs. Keep those hips low. Keep your balance. Keep the inside and sides working. Yeah, come on, keep going. Last one. Ten seconds. Big 20 seconds for the sprints now. Deep breath, ready? Here we go. On the spot. Put the arms through. Absolutely can in these sprints. Three, two, one. Rest. Last exercise, down to the ground, crucifix plank. Arms out, on the toes. Hold that weight above your hands. Push down into the ground, your palms so you don't slip. Squeeze that core. Tighten everything up. Round two, dusted. We breathe. Okay. Last round, big round, 18 seconds on for three movements with no rest. 180 push ups, here we go. Show it down, walk it up. 180 movement. Hard as we can here. It's only 18 seconds. In out, cross out, jumps. Here we go. Remember, it's going to height. 
jump up, kick out, jump up, pull in. B sit freeze onto your bums. 18 seconds here. You're gonna have more of a shake this time because those legs have that chance to rest. Woo! Keep it up. Ready for skaters? Are we come. Take it in. We jump across. My bad. I thought we was resting after every three. I'm doing wrong. All your press ups down to the ground. Here we go. Working on the inside of that chest. Hot knees, team. Spin around. Here we go. Same thing again. It's the highest round for this. Don't move off until you're secure. Knees low to the ground. Last rep. 20 seconds recovery. Second six exercises. Furby squat for us for 18 seconds. Ready? Here we go. Really tuck those knees up, kick those heels out, and land low speed. Ready for your rebound, little jump. Straight into it. Rebound, we jump. Spin around. Rebound, we jump. Rebound. Come on. Ready for the reverse plank team? Take it down. Hands down, heels down, hips up. Slow and steady with the breathing, take a deep breath in. Lateral squat walk. Bring it up. Straight down with a bum. Let's walk here. Come on. Work with me. Keep the lungs moving. Sprint! Sprint, let's go! 18 seconds, all we got! Down to the ground, crucifix plank. We're holding it out for a while. Get your brain sorted, weight over the hands, and think about you doing something else right now. Not holding this. Regression if you need it, come down to your knees. We're gonna hold this for 60 seconds. We're already 20 seconds in. Yes. You wanna make it harder, bring the chest down a bit. Feeling the shoulders. We're almost there, team. Keep the bums up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And rest. I told you it was going to be intense. It was pretty mad. Big 24 minutes there, the heart rate's going, the lungs are going, the whole body's perspirating, and you should be feeling great now. If you want to be doing something else after this, I'll put a link and it'll probably go around here for some core exercises. You can do a 12 minute core workout or finish with some burpees. Me and my team done this workout and we finished with 100 burpees. 10 sets of 10 burpees to finish. I challenge you. Let me know in the comments how you got on.